factorise completely. Uh, 10x squared minus 2x. Not dissimilar from the factorisation we had earlier, except that we can now take a number as well as an x out. So uh, 2 is our numbers, uh, but we can also take an x. So 2x, uh, and we've got 5x, uh, and minus 1, 1 times 2x. This factorisation, um, it's a quadratic, uh, so it's likely to be two brackets. Um, and actually this is a special one called the difference of two squares, because this is a square uh, and this is a square. Um, and if I'm going to do it in the grid, we've got x squared, we've got minus 9. Um, and x times x makes x squared. And what makes this has got to be nothing? Well, if I have 3 and minus 3, that will give me minus 3x and plus 3x which will give me no x altogether, that's going to be minus 3. So my brackets are x plus 3 and x minus 3. Um, now we move on to this one which is factorising, a slightly trickier factorisation because it's got 3x squared and so because it's prime one of them's got to be 3x and one of them's got to be x I've got to make 4 down here, so that can either be 4 and 1, or 2 and 2. Well, 2 and 2 is not going to give me my minus 13x, so uh, I reckon that's going to be 4 and 1. 4 times 3 to make the 12, uh, and 1 to make the 13, but they've both got to be minus to make the minus 13. So that's minus 12x and minus x, give me my minus 13, that will give me positive 4. So my brackets are 3x minus 1 and x minus 4.